What's happening, y'all? It's your boy JB Trucking back with another video, man. I know it's been a long time since I uploaded a video, but here I am, man. Just the new year, 2024. Happy New Year to everyone. Uh, happy holidays. You know, I hope everybody had a great Christmas and a happy new year. But um, if you're new to the channel, man, hit that subscribe button. Also, give this video a thumbs up. I greatly appreciate it. We almost at 10K, man. I know I ain't been consistent. Y'all already know, man. I only pretty much upload during the time that i'm uh, out there on the road and uh i only do trucking seasonal you know i'm right i'm here at work right now waiting to start my shift though but if you're new to the channel i only do trucking part-time and i did this back in 21 when i started my business with the hopes of it booming and um i ain't gonna say it's been booming though but it's been this you know uh obstacles of uh ups and downs and everything like that though but only the strong can survive this type of industry and business so um, I'm gonna give y'all a little, you know, a little brief um, background if you're new to the channel. So I was starting my business, of course, 21. I couldn't lease on to a company because I didn't have a driver's license. I made a video, I forgot last year or the year before, on, on the reason why I couldn't lease on to a company. So I was forced to, you know, start my own thing. And uh, in the midst of that, it's pretty much been uh, been doing good, you know. So um gonna get right back i mean get into this video right now so i want to give you all a recap on uh 23 uh my last load that i did was in august i dropped that last load it was like uh like an illinois illinois and wisconsin picked up and then dropped off all in georgia so that was my last run that i did and um i had pretty much was done i thought i wasn't gonna be able to get back into business because the insurance was so damn high but Hey, I made a way and um, still making way right now. I'm not going to tell y'all that it's easy or whatever. It's difficult as hell um, during these times of, you know, hardship. You know, the load's not paying well. Brokers getting over uh, carriers and doing shady stuff. But at the end of the day, I'm just going to continue to do what I got to do, man, you know. But um, show, I'm going to share with y'all on what I had uh, factored with truck stop. I'm going to be blunt with y'all. I always kept the real, nothing to hide. And uh, I'm going to show y'all right now. All right, y'all. So this was what I uh, factored from uh, April all the way to August is what I factored. And uh, the calculation of all this end up came, uh, like before all the deductions and everything like that, it came out to like $71,743. So it came out to that $71,000 gross right that's not net at all i wish it was but i made i made all that uh for the business and pretty much a lot i didn't we the business didn't see none of that you know what i'm saying everything that was coming in was going straight out to uh expenses fuel and insurance we all know that insurance is done skyrocketed high so a lot of that stuff that I, all the money that came into the business most definitely was just maintaining the business to stay afloat. So um, I ain't gonna make this video too long, but I, I do have to come out of pocket my own personal, uh, uh, you know, funds to kind of help cover the business, uh, uh, you know, expenses. And that's what's expected, you know what I'm saying? When it comes to uh, owning the business and when you like the third party guarantor, meaning that you're co-signing for your business. If the business can't pay for it, you got to pay for it. <laughs> so I just want to let y'all know that part. You know what I'm saying? And I'm going to make another video explaining um, another move that I made that, you know, I felt like at the time it was the right move, though. But now that I'm, uh, you know, seeing it for what it is, I wish I didn't make that move. But we live and learn, we, you know, go through mistakes, trial and error. So that's all I, you know, can do. And that's all we can do is, trial and error you know what i'm saying but uh again like i said before in the beginning only the strong uh survive but i just want to say this y'all hopefully 24 be or yeah hopefully 24 be a better year in trucking you know what i'm saying last year wasn't that great um wasn't that great 22 was great 21 was great so with that being said man if y'all still out there that's still trucking Salute to y'all. Continue to, uh, you know, keep them wheels rolling and uh, don't take no cheap freight. But uh, until next time, man, it's your boy JB Trucking checking out with another video. Peace.